What's up, guys? It's back here, and we are back into some more Don't Starve mod mashup. So, going in, back to, we're on day three, our Weber start. I'm going through here. It has been a day or so since I played. I was trying to remember. No, we haven't. Uh, if we had set up a base, but we have not. We were still trying to decide where exactly we wanted to go, and... I wanted to explore just a hair bit more. There's nothing quite interesting over here um, that we need. We're going to want a good amount of like meat and such that we can um, you know, drive. So maybe finding a good area of rabbits would be nice. But I don't think we've seen anything too exciting. We can't step near pigs, so we don't want to... Um, stuff there like last time. Finding a bunch of close-knit rabbit dens would be very good. So that's kind of what I'm thinking. I just have not quite decided. Um, but we are kind of full on inventory. So I don't want to continue wandering around too much longer. Um, getting a backpack would be huge right now. Um, I'm also thinking sitting up next to some wobsters would be good. But... I have not seen any, like, if there was one with, like, two or three, either right off the coast or in, like, little, um, not quite a river, but, like, an alcove in the generation would be super nice. But, alas, we will see. Lots of freaking plants. Oh, another tall birds. Double eggs. So nice. Tall bird here. It'd be good to, like, run dogs to, but there's not, like, that many of them. It's not like a tall bird fortress or anything, so... I don't know. It might not be quite what we're wanting. We could steal the eggs, but... Eh. Not too satisfied. There is a lot of good stone here, though, and a lot of gold, which would be good to do setup with. Um, but I'm not... Not impressed yet. Another patch of inky blackness. Grass. There's nothing like... Useful. Another bunny rabbit, but it's only one hole. One bunny hole. And the, the map is kind of, this generation's like, very mixed. A lot of, like, uh, grassland and then mixed biome beside it. Ah. I still don't know, because I don't know if the beef flow hate us. I can't specifically remember with Weber. Um, but kind of the idea was to find more spiders, too, to set up near... That way we can have more defenses. Um, but I'm not really seeing like a good deserted forest. Uh, oh, this connects farther down, I think. Uh, it does? No, it's the end right there. So here's one of these good rivers. Let's walk up along it and see if we can find any lobsters. Okay, and there is a good little inlet point over here that could be worth building on one side since this whole side of the island is kind of segregated. Here's where... No, the crossing's up here. That's getting dust already. We could build a crossing here. We could fill this area of the map with um, spike traps right here. So anything that tries to come over and take damage could be worth it. I don't see any anything else quite exciting over here, though. But I do think this will be the site we build on. Plenty of stone. Got some good trees. We'll have to, like, move everything. I don't want to spend another night wandering um, because we need to set up a base. We need to get a bag. Um, and we need to start getting a shovel and collecting supplies because I did not do that soon enough last time. I don't really want to make the exact... Same mistake. I think right here we got two berry bushes, some trees nearby for tonight. I think this is where we are going to set up our fire pit. Boom. Let's go ahead and get the science machine down and start to build. Alright. I'm survival. What can we make? Backpack? Yes. There we go. Good start. Let's go ahead and remove this thing here. Go ahead and grab our shovel with that. And we really want to get some wood and make um, 
some chests. We, we get a lot of random stuff from the, um, the whatchamacallit, the mobs dropping things. So it might be good to get chests and start organizing all that stuff. Um, we have the feathers, we have the pigskins, um, so that will be part of what we do. We also get, starting as Weber, let's go ahead and plant this right here. Spider friends, hello. So this will be kind of our defensible area, um, and we will continue to get more spiders as we get a chance. But they should be able to help guard us um, in the event of emergencies. It's not the biggest, but they will continue to build up the base and make it bigger as time goes on. But that should help. And we get the little the little uh, animal den here, which should be nice to have. Okay, we're going to have to go invest in pine cones because we do not have any currently. Um, get some right here. Just so we can start up a forest and so we don't get any tree guardians right off the bat because that would be uh, very sad. Okay, and there we go. Oh, oh no, we have 15. Why did I, why did I say that? I lied. All right, let's make a good little tree area up here. If I can get them to plant. Plant. Thank you. All right. Uh, ooh, put some bad fuel. Low, low there. All right, let's go ahead and cook up some food. I don't remember if there's a downside to eating for Weber. No, we still can eat normal foods uh, without an issue. Um, let's see, let's go ahead and make stacks here of nonsense that we don't need to carry to start with. Let's go ahead, actually I might go ahead and make the chest for this. Because that'll be actually kind of useful. Three, um, what kind of structures do I have access to? Chest, we also have the large chest, but it takes eight. Could be worth it to start off with. I know I added the cellar and stuff. One flooring. But I might not have access to that yet. Scale chest. And then uh, fire prepared. I don't think that's quite what we want. Let's go ahead. Eat though for a large one. That's going to take up most of our wood. Could be worth it though. Go ahead and do that. Five. Ooh, and they're dropping uh, silk already. Which should make surviving winter, which we failed at last time, a bit easier. We just need to start getting some food going. But with the uh, ample forest and stuff nearby, hopefully uh, we can stay near the house. Oh, you suck. <laughs> I was about to chop you down. Um, but with all the stuff nearby, the ample amount of gold, we should be able to get a good setup here, I'm hoping. Um, plenty of walls maybe even set up, which I don't know, I have never done, but we could do that around berry bushes to trap in gobblers. Could be very nice. Um, yeah, that's kind of the stuff I'm thinking of. I'll try to be a little bit more strategic than last time. And maybe set up a more expansive base network. Fighters in the center. We need to go and grab stuff while we're here though. Okay. Um, we can refine as we walk. One, two, three. Oh, I didn't do the last one. Uh, Okay, there's the boards we need. Grab this stuff as we go. Um, I don't know how many farms we're gonna be making this time. Because they take so much tending currently that I'm not like fully set on them yet. Um, but we will see. Lots of stone, lots of gold. Okay. Another one. I wait I wonder if there's a mod, might be the next one I look for, that automatically makes another tool when you're through with the last one. Be very useful. Okay, equip the shovel. Grab the flint as we walk. Just to have. Okay, we need to find materials and relocate them. Because, yeah, we're going to want 10 or 20 of the different kind of bushes. Uh, we're going to want berry bushes, which we have none of right now. Well, we have like one. But we're going to want an actual, like, livable amount of them. I'm going to leave some of them available. I don't want to clear out our island completely um, since we are kind of like segregated from the rest of the land masses. 
I would like to move over here to dig up all this stuff. That way, anything that's close by the base, we can um, keep for ourselves and let them grow without having to fertilize them. Because we don't have any rot currently, so we might want to also dig up some flowers while we're here. To let that start converting down. Like that. Now let's pick this flower. Yeah, I'm not too worried. Also, I think um, I've I've realized and thought about it. Um, one of the mistakes I made on our first one with Frogtopia is I think, and I might be wrong, you can collect and kill frogs with um, traps, with the falling traps, and I might try setting that up because I know there's another frog area. See the frog right there. Um, somewhere close by. Yeah. So what I'm going to do this time is be smarter. Build two traps, maybe? Oh, I can only make one. Um, let's go ahead and set this trap over here. There's plenty of frogs. Let them walk around, do their frog thing, and hopefully we can collect a couple froggies. Alright, we do need to get grass. That will be a problem. But the frogs will be good for the frog legs and making more uh, meat to hang up. Which we also need to um, get more wood while we're down here. Which we need to do. Oh, that's not the one I want to cut. Uh, already getting night. Low on cut grass. Got five, but again, no rot to sustain it. Keep cutting some of these trees down for this. Only one berry bush, too. Our food supply is not the best. So, we have to keep that in mind. But, one of the advantages we have this time is more access to spider spider silk. Not have last time. Okay, quit the shovel again. Let's go get the grass. These are the ones we want. Boop. Grab all this. Now, the twigs, the advantage is you don't need to um, fertilize them. So, if we get 20 of those, I'll be pretty happy. I've already collected a lot of these. So I don't want to really grab them again because you can, you know, harvest and pick them up in the same motion. I guess it doesn't matter either way, technically, but it's a little bit, you know, better on time management. It would suck if you had to harvest it and then dig them up. We've also not explored this area too much, so kind of about it. Another freaking sinkhole. A lot of them nearby. Okay, here we go. This is a pretty good area. And there's some more grass to our lower left. All right. We're gonna break our shovel pretty soon. I don't know if it's better to dig and then um, pick up. Could be uh, like a preferred method to this. And there we go on that. Make another one. There's plenty of grass over here. And I feel like it's more useful than twigs. Twigs are great for just the normal day-to-day um, -day building tools and such, but the grass I feel like is in a lot more recipes. We got 10. I'd like 20. And then we can worry about fertilizing it as we get a chance. Okay. Have 13 of those. I might make a forest fire over here tonight to also start promoting charcoal. Um, I think these birch trees will be fine. You you can get trail mix from them by cutting down the full ones, um, or the ability to make trail mix. However, I feel like the birch tree guardian <clears throat> is a little more cumbersome to fight overall compared to the normal one. That's what I'm kind of thinking. I don't think I have a torch currently. Got two. Mine. Another couple seconds here. We can get the rest of those here. Alright, 15 of these. Alright. And torch. And equip. Right in time. The problem right here is there's no trees that close together. Let's go with this one. Alright, unequip that. Uh, Re-equip my shovel. We are pretty full. All right, so we got 10 of those. Let's grab this. They got the sapling. Ooh, getting a little toasty over here. But this should be 
Um, plenty of whip, looks like these ones too. Materials um, to get us very, very well going. These extra berry bushes here are kind of what I wanted to see more than anything. Um, but 20, 20, and then these three right here will also be 20 saplings. So this should be more than enough to um, keep us going for a while. Alright, we're also going to like these ones. Alright. We are pretty full up on stuff. Let's go ahead and plant some of these pine cones here. Just to promote our forest industry. Uh, drop this for now. I want the charcoal more than anything. Boop. And then we're going to... Ooh, roasted... Oh! I did not know that just burning these created roasted birch nuts. That's new. And very exciting, actually. Alright, ow. Yeah, that's a new food source I didn't even consider. Because those are what you use to make the trail... Um, the... Not trail nuts, the trail mix. So if we could get a good stash of those put together and then burn them when they get tall, could be rewarding. Oh, they must not drop them all the time. They must be just like a low chance for them to. Unfortunate, you could kill two birds with one stone that way. I will cut one down and um, replant though, because it is pretty shy over here in terms of um, the amount available, so. Let's go ahead and replant. Keep up the population. We do not want to deforest too much. All right. Uh, we didn't get a ton of charcoal. We'll have like five or seven when we're done here. Have to go do this again. Be somewhere a little bit more clustered. There's four. Not quite what I was. Uh, well, this should be enough actually. Go ahead and light this. All right. Usually it's better to do this at night, but while we're out here collecting stuff, I'm not opposed to it. I also will probably make some more traps for frogs as we go up if we can get, yeah, we got 17. Um, if we can get a lot of stuff together. There we go. Okay, it's up to 40 at this. One, and then while these burn, oh yeah, there we go. Nice deforestation fire. Yeah, 10, 10, 10. No more berry bushes nearby, which is Slightly unfortunate, but no, we will make do with what we have. I could do another light here. Equip it. Um, what to do while we wait? They're still going to take a few minutes. Is there any stone over here I can scoop up? No, it looks like it's all rabbit land. What a good grassland. Um, this can be where we come to get more of that as we. Make our way around. A couple more flowers here, I guess. Uh, oh, there's another berry bush. Let's grab that. Uh, two of them, actually. Because if I can get ten of these, too, it'd be pretty nice. I mean, twenty is always, like, the... I think the preferred number, but... You know. You get what you get, and you don't pitch fit. Alright, four on the axe. We'll have to make another one of these, but there we go. Perfect. This should keep us going for a while. We want drying racks. We want to make charcoal. I mean, not charcoal. Uh, crockpot. So hopefully this will be enough to keep us amply supplied for a good bit. Um, it's a little early to go ahead and, like, fully commit to um, a bunch of drying racks. But a few it could be good. I think it's, I like three or four drying racks. Ooh, no, give me this. Um, why are you, oh, put it out. It's still smoldering. Okay. Um, three or four drying racks and then four crock pots. So maybe four of each would be good. I don't know exactly what the quantities I would need to, um, promote that would be. We'll put two of these down here. I don't know how, when the tree guardian actually spawns. There's like a, a ratio of how many trees you've killed probably to... The amount that you planted or it could be a flat number for all i can remember um that once you plant so many um or once you plant another one it resets the timer i don't really remember so we are playing a slight risk reward game right there all right 
And here we go, across our little bridge. Um, and it might be worth making some more, um, some rope bridges. I know that's a thing that I have installed and we haven't tried yet, um, along here just so we can, uh, keep up with what we're doing. Hello, spider friends. I think clean out around here too. Uh, they're gonna eat a lot of the meat that we put around, so we gotta keep that in mind. Um, let's go ahead and make our huge chest. Oh, I need an alchemy engine to build up. That's unfortunate, because I did not know that. Um, we'll have to make that, which means we'll need more wood. A good thing I went ahead and did that. I could plant these in rows, which would probably make more sense, but at the same time, I don't... I, I know I'm going to come down or they're going to get destroyed, so not too worried about it. And these full ones will be very nice right here. So it'll last more space here. Then possibly pitchforking eventually to make some more green land right beside us could be good. I gotta set up our um, grass tub and sapling farms. Right, let me grab my shovel, which is a 4%. I think I only get one of these out. Yep. Make another one. We're going to need to clear a path. Alright, let's get the twigs first in nice little rows here. Kind of offset. I know, spider friend. Very interesting. I guess technically I can plant the grass tufts in the grassland right here, and it actually should not impede their growth, growth at all. I didn't think about Because they are, they, they came from that, that direction, so that actually will work out in our favor. Right here. One right here, if it'll let me. Yep. And these actually might be able to be done the same way. Um, I cannot um, justify it either way. I want one right here somewhere. There we go. They get a little finicky sometimes on planting when they're like examined over top of each other. Like right now. Right there. Boom. Go here. Oh yeah, there we go. Now these ones are going to be a little more annoying because we have to um, fertilize all these to make them worth our time in any way. Because if not, they won't grow. A logic. But, ooh, actually, oh, 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 oh. Did not realize it was that close to mine already. One, two, there we go. Um, let's go ahead and make our alchemy into if I can. Um, two cut stone, two doodads. I need cut stone, so I need five cut stone. I don't think I have enough of them. Three. I need more. Um, do I have a pickaxe? I do not. That. Can I make the fire big enough to allow for this? Yes. Oh, I'm gonna put the torch, you dumb dumb. Okay. So I need six more rockfish. Cut this down, spider. Spider, protect me, please. And I meant to cut this down anyway. I just hadn't got around to it. And the silk is just coming. Having these spiders here are going to be great. I don't know what all I can make from silk, but having a silk farm pretty much is awesome. Okay. Uh, oh, I don't need to be over here to refine this. One, two. There we go. And then one, two. Does he eat into our goal a lot, but it's fine. Oh, and it also ate half of our boards. One, two, oh man. It's expensive, but I think it'll be worth it. And we will make it, I guess, right, I'll build it like up here, just above our little rock here. I'm actually going to break this down. Always can get more wood. Okay. Now let's... Oh, I am starving to death. I forgot. That's the thing you have to do is eat. Okay. Two. Three. I've been so focused on pairing that I forgot. I'm not starving. That should be more than enough to fill up his belly for a while. Oh, he's getting heat stroke. There you go. 107. Sweet. Okay. Now. Oh, yeah. Look at that. 
good space. I'm going to start putting everything that I collect that I'm not going to use that quickly. Actually, the charcoal I'll probably use here in just a minute. Um, I can leave everything else on me. Cut stone's fine. Um, let's get the rest of our stuff done. Because I'm going to continuously collect these feathers as these birds do their thing. Um, I'm going to c continuously get the pig stuff. Um, if I pass by them. Uh, I don't know what I'll use it for. I don't know if you can do... You might need it for hand bats. No. Helmets, maybe, will be what I use the pigskin for. Um, but I'm going to continuously get it just by passing by and picking it up. Okay. Um, berry bush is nice to have here. I'm going to leave it. And I think I'll plant the other ones nearby it. Oh, this is going to be frustrating. Because, yeah, it's going to be wet. Yeah, we'll, we'll plant these up here. Maybe make another um, fire pit nearby. Plant these. It is next to our little forest here. Uh, I did not plan this out very much. Um, I just kind of picked the place. So we will make it into our own. But I will probably put walls around this eventually uh, to catch those gobblers who are in our way. But we do have some semblance of a little base going on here. Um, let's throw this flowers out to rot as we want them to do. Grab this. Cut this up. Very nice. And we have three boards. Uh, we, I think the next real big phase of our plan will be um, guarding ourselves, uh, getting food going. Let's actually go ahead and look at that. What do I need for drying racks? Probably mostly rope, right? Yeah, three rope, which we can do. Go ahead and do that. Um, we're fine. Just so we also have this thing in mind. And three. So we can also make these now. Start getting this going. I don't have any meat to put on it. And then I want to know how to make a crock pot. Just so I have these recipes learned, I can build them while we're walking around. Uh, it's mostly stone we need and charcoal. Okay. So that's what we want to get. Stone needed. Impa, I need more stone. Uh, oh, we already have one. Um, I don't know if anyone played that game, um, which would be Stronghold. Uh, Crusaders, I think, is the one I mostly played. I think they came out with the second one and I got it on Steam. Not as good. If you want to see it though, we can watch me be really bad at it because it's been many a years uh, since I actually played it. But fun game. I, I enjoy it a lot. Uh, but they did always complain about not having stone. Um, then you have Command and Conquer um, where the, the GIA always wanted shoes. I need more. Can, do you have any shoes? Uh, that's like the, the two lines I remember from those games was stone needed because you always, I always ran out of that built excessive walls and people wanting shoes, which there was no tell for that. That's just one of the things that happened in you click the workers. You actually could not give them shoes, I don't think. Maybe you could. There might have been an upgrade for shoes. I don't exactly remember. It's been a few years. Okay. This should be plenty of gold, plenty of stuff. I also want to get the bird cage soon. All right, give me this. Thank you. Because um, I think that'd be a nice thing to have. Um, and there's tons of birds with bird feathers. Which I don't know exactly what they'll be good for. But I know we can feed the birds stuff that are, is rotting and uh, keep it for longer. Alright, do this. Bow. Um, throw these in here. And what do you think? Uh, Crockpot, where are you at? Food. I thought it was right at the top here. Food. Oh, it is. Oh, we need more stuff. Yep, that's what it is. How many of these do I want to commit to to start with? Two. Two. Three. Four. Because you really want to do, like, that with the bridge in the middle. I think I will do them maybe right here, then. Why can't I do another one? Oh, I need twigs and stuff? Oh. I didn't realize I was out of that basic resource. Am I also out of charcoal, did it say? No, twigs and stone. So one more stone. Twigs. Do I have time to walk around and find a twig? I need more than one, though. We'll just wait for our next harvest. That's fine. Go ahead and also cut down this tree. Yep. We only have three woods left. But we're making great progress. Twigs are going to be necessary. But now we can actually... Yeah, he's already hungry. Uh, start making some food. 
we really need that rot and stuff. Um, so maybe going Spelunkin for the shine bulbs? The, the, the thing I'm thinking of? Um, the bulbs. Glow bulbs. Glow bulbs. Something like that. Um, is going to be crucial um, to getting more rot. They're easy. I don't know if we can harvest them and move them to. Um, something I need to try because I've not tried it. Um, but those will be awesome for continuing our, um, to get all the stuff done. Because I don't know what the beefalo are and they might not like me. So I don't really want to take the chance. Ooh, hello, nighttime. We are now friends. Um, also a bug net might be what I get something today. There's some fireflies right here. Do this, unequip. Actually, let's see if we can make that. Survival, bug net. Need one rope. You know what? Worth it. Because this will also get us. Bug net will get us fire fun, right? Oh, they, they left. How do I catch these? Oh, that's just. One. Catch. Catch. And boom. Those are awesome to get so early on. Because that means we can make nice things. Uh, I'm going to put the. Equipment that we're not using down at the bottom. Look at that. We have made so much good progress. But that is going to be where I wrap it up for today. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, you can hit that like button. Or, if you prefer, you can subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.